Hi, my name is Aya, and in this video I'll be teaching you how to chunk worms. Chunking worms is moving worms from one plate to another. Here are all the materials. We have a dissecting scope, Bunsen burner, lighter, disposable waste bin, your worm plates, square-ended spatula, your data table, and your writing utensil. First, you light your Bunsen burner. Then you remove the lid off of your wild type worms. Place the plate under your dissecting scope and turn the bottom light on. Adjusting the scope as necessary, find the most populated region. Using your sterilized spatula, cut a rectangle around that region. Then divide it into two pieces. Scoop up one of those pieces and place it worm side down on your empty low salt plate. Remember to put it around the rim. Using a Sharpie, mark your drop site on the bottom of your Petri dish. Then flick off the chunk into your disposal bin. Record your time. After sterilizing your spatula, scoop up the second piece and repeat the remaining steps for your high salt plate. Remember to cover all your plates as soon as possible in order to minimize contamination. After you finish with your wild type worms, you move on to the mutants. Remember to sterilize between each new plate. Place your plate under the dissecting scope, find the most populated region, and dissect it. Remember to cut it into two different pieces for your low salt and high salt places. Scoop up the pieces and place them worm side down on the rim of your low salt and high salt plates. Remember to outline the drop site. Also, after each plate, record the time. Here is a time-lapse version of transferring your two pieces onto your low salt and high salt plates. Just a few helpful reminders when chunking worms. Always sterilize your spatula. Be very careful over the flame. Always place your chunks worm side down. And always write down your data as soon as possible.